guys it's your girl royalty blog and today i wanted to talk about um carmelo anthony um being seen on a yacht with a married side chick and before i get into the video um i do want to say thank you guys for still watching my videos and commenting on my old videos because it has been about two weeks since i have dropped a video and this is because i've been really busy i moved and also my my birthday was um independence day so i have been really busy um i did not have time to talk about the whole Carlo, carmelo anthony and Lala Anthony scandal <clears throat> but today I did want to talk about um, Carmelo Anthony being seen on a yacht and I also wanted to talk about Lala Anthony and the affair that she had with Ludacris and Mano back in the day so basically I just want to read this article here um, to give you guys a backdrop on basically what has been surfacing around on the web about Carmelo Anthony. Um, I know you guys probably have already gotten this tea from other YouTubers, but I do wanna give a backdrop of the situation so that I can move into the whole Lala Anthony and Ludacris scandal. So this article basically says that Carmelo Anthony was seen with the mystery beauty um, on a yacht and so, um, the article says the curvaceous beauty was spotted on a yacht in the south of France with NBA star Carmelo Anthony and has been identified as Sarah Samiri. According to multiple sources, an insider revealed to page six that she's married and Samiri is not her current last name. So Sarah and the former Knicks star last week promoting blogs to speculate that Melo is cheating yet again on wife Lala Anthony. So a source confirmed to page six that Samiri is 28 and single despite Anthony um, releasing a video shooting down the cheating rumors and, and claims that he that she was married. So here's a picture of Carmelo Anthony um, sunbathing with this lady um, on a yacht who he claims to be married. So basically, um, hours after the photo circulated, Carmelo Anthony spoke to TMZ Sports and said the woman was actually on the yacht with her husband and the rest of her family. He claims he was there with a friend while in Europe on a business retreat. So he said, y'all trying to expose somebody's wife, Melo said in the clip, y'all exposing somebody's kids. Leave that alone, man, that ain't cool. So I will not read everything that Carmelo had to say. Instead, I'll just put the clip up. I want you guys to check out this clip of what Carmelo Anthony had to say, and I'll be right back with my commentary. So I'm addressing this one time and one time only, and I'm really only addressing it for my family. Keep my family out this, man. I'm over here trying to do my business retreat. I'm over here trying to have a good time. I'm on a boat with some friends. Them people are married, man. They ain't got, they don't got nothing to do with anything. Y'all trying to expose, y'all exposing somebody's wife, y'all exposing somebody's kids, all that. Like, come on. Leave that alone, man. That ain't cool. Now, I got to deal with that. I got to deal with that with my son. I got to deal with that with my wife. That ain't cool, man. That's not cool at all. Let them people live. All them blogs that's trying to put that out there, that shit is not cool at all. It's not cool at all. Let that family be. They, they married. Let them people be them people. Man, them people some real discreet people, man. They up there like that. They don't be in the world like that. They do their own thing. Y'all doing too much, man. And the only reason I'm addressing this is because this is affecting my family now. And y'all got y'all got me out here looking crazy. Usually I won't address this, but I, I had to address this. Can't let this one slide. Cause this shit ain't cool no more. So basically, after Carmelo Anthony released this video to TMZ Sports, Thursday morning, Lala seemed to respond to the images of her man with the mystery blind woman by posting and deleting a photo of a bloody heart with a bullet through it on Instagram. Basically, the picture was suggesting that she had been left heartbroken by betrayal yet again because you guys do know that Carmelo Anthony has fathered a little girl 
by a woman who was supposed to be his side chick. And now that Lala Anthony has found out about this side chick and this side baby, the side chick is claiming that Lala isn't allowing Carmelo Anthony to see his child. In my opinion, I don't think that it's not, I don't think it's Lala not allowing Carmelo to not see the child. I think it's just that Carmelo knows that he has messed up. And in order for him to try to fix things with his wife and make things go back to normal with her, he wants her to basically forget that there's a side baby, which that's pretty much impossible. Um, but anyway, of um, his ex-mistress, um, who's now his baby mama, she basically went on an Instagram rant about how he had time to lay up on a yacht with a married woman, but doesn't have time for his daughter, that she claims that Lala Anthony won't let him see. So basically, you guys, um, I wanted to move on to the tea I got about Lala Anthony and Ludacris having an affair back in the day. Okay, for those of you who aren't aware, Luda and Lala worked at a radio station together many years ago. Since then, the rapper slash actor has always been very supportive of her, as Luda's seen her grow from a young teen to an adult in the tough entertainment industry. So imagine his and everyone's shock when we all learned that, Lala, that Lala's head has been in the gutter about him. Now here's what happened. On an MTV show called Safe Word, Lala was hooked up to a lie detector test. From there, another one of Lala's best friends, Kelly Rowland, asked her the question, have you ever had an exotic dream about Ludacris? Luda, of course, was standing right next to Kelly, and she read this. That's when Lala said flat out no. However, the person who was monitoring the test said that she had been lying. Embarrassed, Lala Anthony immediately jumped up and tried unwrapping herself from the lie detector test. Roland, Luda, and the crowd couldn't believe it. So basically, here's where things get messy. So I want to show you guys the MTV clip of Lala being hooked up to the lie detector test. The clip is only about 10 seconds because I don't want to get hit for any copyright claims. So I want you guys to check out this clip and I'll be right back. We're going to hook you up to a lie detector. Have you ever had an erotic dream about Ludacris? No. Is she telling the truth? <laughs> So back in 2017, around July, when that MTV Safe Word show came out, a lot of fans start speculating that just because Lala and Ludacris had spent so much time together over the years that they were having an affair because, you know, Ludacris had a wife at the time and Lala, Anthony, and Carmelo was dating at the time and is still dating right now. So basically, um, this article says Lala Anthony's husband, Carmelo, is angry that she did not invite him to the Ludacris birthday party in France. So a lot of fans were speculating also that the reason why she didn't invite her husband to Ludacris's 40th birthday party is because of the affair that the guys were having. So basically, the article says Lala Anthony is now driving her estranged husband, Carmel Carmelo Insane, the power actress who filed for divorce earlier this year, is open to taking the basketball star back. But before she does that, she has decided to have some fun at his expense. Recently, she flew to Paris, France to attend a lavish birthday bash throne for rapper Ludacris, who turned 40. Lala dazzled at the event in a black gown that showed her ample assets. The former radio personality shared a few photos from the event online. According to a source, Carmelo became very jealous. So I want to take you guys down here to show you the picture that Lala wore to Ludacris's 40th birthday bash. So basically, she didn't invite Carmelo to come. Carmelo really wanted to come to the birthday bash because he didn't want his wife to be out dressing very sexy and then lose her to another man after he has cheated and everything. So someone said that right now Lala's taking it slow. She does not feel like she needs to rush into a decision either way. She is going to take as long as she needs and Carmelo is fine with that because he's using the time to win her back. As long as it's 
long as it is not a no from her, he has got the chance to make it a yes. He is up for the challenge. He is very clear he wants her back and will wait as long as she needs. So basically, I was on Instagram and I was reading a lot of the comments um, under under Lala and Carmelo's post, you know, because they have been very heavy in the media ever since um, Carmelo was seen on a yacht with the mystery woman. And also because, you know, he went out and made a side baby with an alleged side chick. So basically, fans are basically saying that this is Lala's karma because she had an affair with Mano back in the day and she also had an affair with Ludacris. Um, I'm not sure how true any of this tea is. I want you guys to give me your thoughts and your opinions about this whole Carmelo and Lala scandal. Also about um, Lala Anthony supposedly um, having an affair with Ludacris. Um, I want you guys to let me know if you guys think it's true or not. And if you guys have any receipts about this, you guys, please feel free to leave comments below. Thank you guys for watching my videos. Don't forget to hit the like button, the share button, and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching my videos. If you guys enjoy my videos and want to see the channel grow, you can like the videos and subscribe to my YouTube channel. You guys can also donate to the channel at cash app slash princess chun -Li. Thank you guys for watching my videos and don't forget to subscribe.